welcome to my channel. So I've been shopping a little bit and I haven't done one of those new in kind of hauls of just hodgepodge of stuff I've gotten. So I thought why not do that today? So let's just get started actually with my earrings. If you saw my Dries Let's Go Shopping vlog that I did, I think a few weeks ago, if you haven't seen it, I'll link it below. I purchased these earrings. So I just thought I would show them here in case you haven't seen the vlog. Then I did another shopping vlog where me and my mom visited Bastion Island in Orange County and I bought a pair of, let me show you, ta-da! I love them so much. Uh, I believe that this is the second version of them. They're a little smaller and they're a little less in your face. And I think they're a little more everyday. Both of these earrings I'm definitely gonna be wearing a lot. Okay, next item. So I did another shopping vlog at Cabazon Outlets with my mom as well, and I'll link that below as well. I ended up getting a pair of these super cute Loewe glasses. Cute, right? I really, really love them, and I actually saw them at the Webster the other day uh, for like full price at the Loewe outlet at Cabazon. These glasses were $136, and they had every color in the rainbow. I'm really into these, and I'll definitely be back to Cabazon. Anywho, moving on. Okay, the next one is a new baby, which is this Christian Dior by John Galliano little kind of a baguette style bag. A lot of the bags in this season had this whole car theme going on with headlights and a license plate that says Chris 1947. And then it has this really cool steering wheel that looks like Mercedes, but it's CD instead. And then the whole bag is denim patched with this leather that's perforated. Perforated leather really looks like a car seat. This is such a 2000s iconic bag to me. And you know, I'm just like totally obsessed with Galliano Christian your stuff. Not too long ago I got oh, the denim saddle bag. I'll link that video below. I'm so into all the Galliano Dior. It's so freaking cute. So this bag is actually going to be in a vlog. I do hope you watch that vlog. It's gonna be the next video. I got it actually at a consignment store in Carmel. I also got a super cute t-shirt. Ta-da! I got a shirt. This was in like central California, middle of nowhere, like Salinas Valley gas station. And I ended up snagging like a freaking cute shirt. Who says you can't shop anywhere? You can shop anywhere. See, I told you, very random purchases, but I love it. Ta-da! I got my checkered coat. If you saw my coat collection video, in that video I mentioned that it's something that I was lusting over and I couldn't decide between the two colorways. Guess what? It's been selling out. Yeah, I don't think I can wait for the sale, so I got it. I don't like to buy things not on sale. I had like my Teresa credit, so, and honestly, I've been looking at my Teresa for a while and I've been wanting to use that credit, so there it is. I love this coat. Up next are these boots that I purchased on the Real Real. They're Celine, they're Phoebe Philo Celine. I wanted these when they first came out and I didn't get my hands on them. So they're one of my holy grails and I got them. I'm definitely a little bit of a collector of Phoebe Philo Celine. These were a special little addition to my Celine collection. I love these and I can't wait to wear them. Last but not least, I have a couple like little beauty things. So the first thing is Byredo. So by Rado is a perfume maker from Sweden, really beautiful perfumes. They also do body washes, lotions, and all of that. They're kind of like similar to Aesop. So anyway, long story short, by Rado started makeup and they just came out with it. It was a created in a collaboration with a famous makeup artist and I believe her name is Isamaya French. And I peeped her Instagram. She does things that are very unexpected. So I was very intrigued, especially by these things that they're calling color stick. So I bought two of them. So these color sticks are supposed to go anywhere you want it on your face. They can go on your eyes, on your cheeks, it's, they can be highlighter, they can be lipstick, they can be anything. If you're into like contouring and all of that, uh, I think this is probably not the makeup brand for you. Uh, you probably want something heavier and more pigmented. This is definitely something to play around with makeup and experiment and have like fun with makeup. So I got the two colors. So one of the colors, La Scene, is the one I'm actually wearing right now. And it's this coppery color, but it's very buildable. The other color I got, it's called the Purple Stinger. And this one is a wet look. It's this amazing periwinkle color. They just came out with eyeshadow palettes and I think I'm definitely gonna get one. I love it. I love the packaging. There's definitely this Elsa Peretti vibe to it. I think these are even cute Christmas presents, right? The last but not least of 
all my haul stuff. I don't know if I've mentioned this before, but I am a nail art enthusiast and I'm a long nail enthusiast. My nail salon closed, nail swag is over. The nail salons in LA County have still not opened up. And I've honestly, like I'm embarrassed to even show you my nails. I've pretty much abandoned my nails. So I've been shopping on Etsy a lot. So I went on Etsy. I always totally had the wrong idea of what Etsy was. I thought it was like very crafty stuff like that I don't want. I mean, it can be that, it can be anything. Thing. But the thing is, it can be anything. It can be vintage Moschino. It can be vintage Chanel. It can be nails. The possibilities are endless. It can be whatever you want it to be. So what I wanted was new nails. Got three different ones. The main reason that I also love Etsy is because these are all like business women. They're, they're making their dreams come true and I'm all here for it. And I love supporting small businesses, especially in this time that we're dealing with right now. Well, we've come to an end. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, Hit subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.